Hello and welcome back to Cardboard Decoy Plays Tropico. Now, I try to stay away from sophomoric humor, but this is just too good. I'm going to direct your attention to my approval rating right there. Just with that thumbs up. Yeah. Yeah. You see what I'm going for. Okay, cool. Moving on. Uh, hold on. Let me see. Provides education. Higher terrain. Yeah, all I can really do is build another library. All right. Um... I know I just said this like three minutes ago in my time, and you watched it yesterday, and you probably remember better than I do, but now I have no idea what I was going to do. Except for just, uh, you know, expand on everything and try to make things better. But uh, let's let's go ahead and see. We should probably work on our industrialization a little bit. But let me... Hmm. Let's bring up the bars. I'm going to do beauty. Where is beautiful, and how can we make it better? And we can maybe turn this whole section into... Sort of a uh, tropical paradise. Current pollution, trees, tsunami, volcano. It's a bad tsunami location, but you know, volcano is not over there, so that's pretty good. Let's uh, let's start working on beautifying this place and turning it into an entertainment and tourism mecca. So I think that might be a decent idea. Ancient ruins. Oh my goodness! Come to tropical. See the ancient ruins. Of our ancestors, which isn't true because we are actually imperial uh, imports, but, you know, whatever. Uh, ancestors. These were our ancestors in ancient times. And now we are capitalizing on what is more than likely their graves. But, you know, that's cool. Okay, and then uh, let's uh, beautify some of this. Hacienda. Six room service quality nearby. Depends on beauty. Is increased for each colonial building nearby. Residential colonial building. What the hell is colonial building mean? Uh, service service qualities increase for each colonial building. Well, I, I'm not sure what they mean by colonial building. I guess maybe older buildings that we had, or like the original tier one buildings. Uh, that I guess is maybe what they're talking about. Interesting. Okay, let's go ahead and we'll we'll just build a hacienda over here and then we're going to increase the beauty large garden let's uh, pick a good one yeah pool pool increase that beauty get that beauty up all right and oh yeah it's already quite up isn't it all right and then uh, that was a really vague uh, reference to an old uh, Kate Kim Lovely Momo video of uh, Princess Maker. So, in case that sounded weirdly familiar, that's probably why. Okay. That's not exactly, uh, what do you call it? A, 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 oh my god. Symmetrical. There we go. It's not at all symmetrical, but it is rather beautiful. So, uh, now we need colonial buildings. So, well, first and foremost, we need money. We need to wait for that to happen again, because we just dumped a lot of money on these two things. So, entertainment, ancient ruins, artifact smuggling, activate to generate Swiss bank profits, but the service quality will be decreased by 25. Interesting. We should have uh, job quality reduced by 10. Maximum budget, altruist, increases wealth for... Yeah, sure. Higher. And we gotta wait for that to actually get built. What do we have for upgrades here? Alien artifacts. Slob tourists are added as a preferred tourist class. Interesting. USSR sends me $9,000. Fantastic. Okay. Keep sending me money so I can continue to reap the benefits of, uh, you know, having money. That's, that's always cool. And, uh, yeah. We do need to upgrade these at some point. I did manage to spend an awful amount of money. Uh, meat foreign standing. Let's go ahead and we are going to add a ship there and work on our foreign standing here. We're going to add a tobacco ship, natural gas logs, and rum. Perfect. We're going to add two ships to that because that's just too good. Furniture, logs, tobacco. We're going to add another ship here and another ship there. And we're just adding another ship there. Okay, cool. So, we do have a tobacco farm somewhere, I believe. Plantation, we got tons of sugar farms. That's pineapple, cotton, coffee, no tobacco? I don't think we have a tobacco farm. Let's fix that. We need to do that really quick. 
Plantation, tobacco, tobacco. It's not quite tobacco, but I had to make a Simpsons reference just because. All right, there we go. Cool deal. And now we'll actually have trade routes set up, and hopefully we'll be pulling in a little bit more money. And our scaffolding has changed. It's now concrete-ish looking. Or, I don't know, maybe that's gypsum board. That doesn't seem very stable for scaffolding, though, so I'm probably wrong. Either way. El herb perdido. I don't know what that means. Okay. But very cool. Um, I accept it. A freighter exported tropical goods. Alright, good, good. We need money. We need money fairly quickly here. I don't know what the threshold is for, like, a loss condition and money, but uh, I imagine it's there somewhere uh, after a certain point if we don't make enough money on things. Our trade ships are much cooler looking, for sure. This much is a certainty. Reinforced hull, okay, that's President, all. President, remember that show where we wanted to execute whoever was responsible because of the things they said about you? Well, now we have a solution. Every show is to have an executive or a person we can execute if we don't like what is in the show. That way, everything will be much neater. That's interesting. Okay, cool. So now we have executives for entertainment buildings. Manager, financier. What is this? Uh, building revenue. Okay. That's actually really good. Administrator. Service increased by 10%. Okay, okay. Administrator. Alright, hire. And then... Um, you can be a just some job quality increase financier increase building revenue there cool stuff I don't know how they level up if they even do level up um, what are you you're a grocery uh, well for 20 of the building sure okay some of these I don't even know I'm just like you know I don't want people to have money that's cool they can have the money. As long as I'm getting money, then they can have money too. That's that's the way the world should work, at least. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. Alright, we've got that still being built. This is taking a really long time. Can we please just... Predictive effectiveness 100. Okay. Oh, hey, we can actually see on the map over here what everything looks like. Yeah, we'll try to keep this beautiful and then just add buildings as is necessary for... Uh, whatever they happen to need, so... Mm -hmm. Description, six culture tourist families. Service quality depends on beauty. Priest for each colonial. Uh, beauty, okay. I guess, maybe... We'll see once it's built, and we'll look at some of the numbers and see what it says. But I think we might have it more or less figured out there. Okay. We got all of these guys. Birthplace, happiness, thoughts, allows me to build only shacks. I rented a place, so I rented a place to live. I'm waiting for someone to tell me where to go. I can build a shack or wait for presidency to build me a house. I can sleep on the streets and tax people as a tourist attraction. Interesting. I have a homeless friend. He will know what to do. Alright. Very interesting. Very interesting indeed. I guess those might be rebels. Uh, and they're not happy because they have no housing, but we're working on it. We're getting there, man. We gotta, we gotta get with the program here and figure out how modern times are supposed it to be seems working. I keep underestimating your capabilities. Here we go. More capitalists on the island. Three thousand Swiss bank account. Let's get two free entertainment buildings and build those really quick. Entertainment. We're gonna build a tavern because it's beautiful over here. I am so furious. I cannot believe what just happened. Oh, the rebels are attacking. Okay, that's a we're gonna we're gonna squash them pretty good. Ah, yes, they were apparently aggregating together so that they can cause some chaos. But they happen to do it right next to where we have tanks, so this is gonna end poorly for them. Okay, let's see. We're gonna we're gonna let them play out their whatever their charade here. Upgrade you, machine gun. Yeah, let's go ahead and upgrade you super quickly. And that's basically... Yeah, there we go. The blammy. Oh, taking them out, I think. Your right to rule has expired. Surrender and live. All right. You're not really giving us any kind of meaningful things to uh, think about there. Although, apparently, they took us out. They took out one of my units. Surrender and 
Interesting. They're actually doing really good against me. Let's see. This might be closer than I thought it was going to be. It doesn't say how much damage is being done to the building, unfortunately. Are they running away now? Uh, we're gonna kill some of the rebels. Good evening. And kill. You have no family. How can I be of help? And we are going to banish you because you have family. No, no, no. And you are going to die. Okay. That should take care of the rebel threat. The town of Cityville. Sorry, I just uh saw my. Uh, I'm achievement up there in the cor corner. Oh, it's the city of Townsville. I get it. Oh, man, what a reference. All right. And... Yeah, at some point, maybe I'll be in jail. And we are going to... Yeah, yeah well off. Banish, discredit, bribe, kill. Yeah. And the USSR sent us some money. We still have some free entertainment buildings to build, so we're going to do that. And let's see. Luxury entertainment. Cabaret. Because cabaret. Cabaret because cabaret. That's, that's pretty much all there is to it. And then we're going to build some more uh, colonial buildings over here, which are basically uh, country houses, I figure. There we go. Very quaint. This will also provide housing for nearby uh, mine workers. So that's not too bad of a deal. And let's see, provides that. Hotel location, effectiveness 105. Not too bad, not too bad at all. Okay, cool. And it looks like nobody's actually, we're not making money here yet. Okay, well, we'll wait, we'll wait and see. I am just trying to, or I've just started out on this particular mechanic, so let's go ahead and build some roads, and some more roads, okay, and whoop, whoop, back to roads, oh dang it, I need to make this longer so it doesn't try to bend over to the end there, okay, cool, and then tourism. Tourism, tourism, tourism. Service quality drops if there are many buildings nearby. For two eco tourists, five slob tourists. It's increase for each increase for each entertainment building nearby. Okay. So we'll get some slob tourists in, but uh, you know that uh, it'll be worth it. We just need to provide more entertainment buildings, like restaurants and whatnot. <clears throat> and we've already got that entertainment building there. So let's see. Let's see. Nice little out-of-the-way spot. This has no workers at the moment. That's interesting. Uh, and then, yeah, we just need to wait for more money. Again, no big deal. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Hey, look at this. Tourist ship. You know what that means. We got us some tourists. All right. So, just in time to get a better idea or sense of what's going on here with this mechanic. Okay, they just dropped off some tourists, maybe? Yes, they dropped off 11 tourists. Okay, so now we have quite the space to be able to house tourists. So, and six culture tourists. Country house. Take me home to the road I belong. Sure. Um, all right, cool. Now we should start making some money. Uh, at least off of the tourist stuff that we've already put money into, so that'll be really, really good. Uh, let me see. Tight quarters. Four families, but housing quality will be decreased, decreased by ten. Alright. We're going to start replacing these. They're actually starting to lose money. Lifetime profit is not good. Yeah. Once they start losing money, they need to go. This is now draining loads of money from me. Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's go ahead and we are going to demolish you and get ready to build a, an actual apartment. Housing quality is increased at place next to a road. Easy peasy. That should be enough room, right? That looks like about the same amount of room as a tenement. All right, let's wait for that to get destroyed and then we'll find out if it's just a one-to-one -one switch or if I need to uh, 
make some changes to uh, how I have everything figured out. Apartment. Oh, no. gotta wait for it to play out. Come on. Okay. Hurrah! There we go. Perfection. Let's do that. Now it's gonna build that apartment. Good times for all. And trades for or exporting tropic and goods. Let's throw up a restaurant right over here. Yeah, perfect. Okay. It's a good thing I did build all those roads. I mean, not everything has that kind of road requirement. Like, uh, this building had the road that was built into it where that green arrow is. But most of the tenements didn't. But I was like, you know, it just seems weird to not have a road there. And now I feel really, really vindicated in that because the apartments require a road to have increased uh, usability. So I don't feel so bad about it anymore. Look at these cranes, though, man. That's impressive technology. I'm really fascinated by, like... I, I, I'm, I'm trying to think of, like, a specific term for it, but any kind of mechanation that requires this kind of uh, trigonometry involved in making it work properly, especially with, like, in regards to load-bearing and movement, that's just too cool to me. I, I like it a lot. I got another achievement called Barrel of Monkeys. I still don't know what that means. Okay. Have you seen the statistics? Seems we are being pinned as a cheap tourist destination which targets the lower traveling class. I suggest we show Tropico has things to offer for both rich and poor tourists. Of course, now it doesn't... Do you see where I'm going with this or do I need to explain? Have four luxury entertainment buildings. Plus ten capitalist relations. Uh, yes. And we already have four of them because we have it opera houses like and stuff. So let's get uh, two free entertainment buildings. We're building a resort, damn it. We need all the entertainment we can get. We need all the entertainment. Uh, ooh, a circus, huh? Beach site, free, provides entertainment to the tourist family. Well, we don't really have anything nearby. Let me see. Does It, it doesn't require beauty. So I think I'm going to... This one will go to the citizens of Tropico first. And then we need a circus. Uh, tourist, preferred tourist class family. And Cineplex, that's modern times. Electricity, build a power plant. Luxury entertainment. Okay, no, it's got to be just normal entertainment. Here we go. It's circus time. It's the circus of value. Since we're building it next to the cheap seats there. Okay. Ancient ruins, museum, hang gliding club. Uh, it's not going to let us... not going to let me build up here. I don't... I, I wish it didn't give me a graph that made me feel like I should have been able to put it up there, but um, at least with the llamas, it definitely does that. It's kind of annoying. Let's do a museum. Like so. Okay, cool. Then we'll let all of that play out. That's good stuff. I'm making... Uh, I like my progress right now. This is all turning out pretty much exactly as I had wanted and hoped and dreamed. Let's see. Residents. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay. So it's slightly less housing than a tenement but let's see wealth required for apartment let's see what that uh, if that's going to be well off or not uh house that's going to be well off do i have any non well off houses yeah everything's got to be well off the mineral oil which can be processed into gasoline the cars in tropical no longer need to run on magic our profits are guaranteed until someone starts selling oil cheaper than us then we should bomb and invade them. Wow. All right. Well, now we can sell oil, which is probably, I think, a little bit lucrative, maybe. Um, I guess we'll find out. But let's see. Country house. We're going to do some more country houses because I believe they have poor requirements. And then we're going to leave the high value ones over here. But we're going to build country homes near the really far... Uh, not money-making kind of industry areas. Okay. And, uh, yes, here we go. We've got some shacks over here. That's something we should be looking for. We upgraded those to houses here. Maybe that wasn't the best idea. Upgrades, nope. Okay. And where else do we have shacks? We've got some shacks downtown. It's true. It's true, it's true. We've just got to, I didn't think about that, but yeah, we've got to provide housing for all socioeconomic classes, not just the well-off. Um, because let's face it, 
most of our people are oppressed and super poor, so... Oh, hey, you just quit on me there. Oh, it's because I have no more money. Okay. Well, we've definitely expanded our housing quite a bit. We are going to try to slowly eliminate the tenements one by one um, as the apartments start to fill up. Let's see. Yeah, these are all starting to fill up. Yes, good, good. Hopefully they're moving out of the tenements that are now losing us just an ass load of money. Let's see. Housing quality. You're next on the chopping block. But we do need money, so we've got to wait for that a little bit. Either way, this is enough for now. I am Cardboard Decoy playing Tropico. If you've enjoyed, please do like, comment, and subscribe. When we come back, we're going to continue to ramp up our uh, luxurious island getaway over here. And then hopefully be able to not only expand on that, but also on some of our infrastructure. There we go. Now we've got money. Good stuff. And, uh, yeah, get rid of some of these older tenements, replace them with apartment buildings, and then see what our population, uh, homelessness, etc., and everything else tends to be doing. So, uh, yeah, if you've enjoyed, please do like, comment, and subscribe. I already said all of that. Now I'm a sellout. Ah, uh, oh, damn it. It happened too soon. I'm too young to be a sellout. That's actually maybe not true. Ew. Ew. Weird. Either way, uh, yeah, until we meet again, have fun.